everybody this is lady eve elements welcome to my tarot channel if you'd like a personal reading all that information is found in the description box below i gotta do some changes to the description box i'm, I'm gonna add the price of my readings and how much they cost i do phone email and facebook messenger readings okay most likely you can go, if you're on my facebook page you can find it on the left hand side of your computer cell phone tablet ipad okay we're going to find out what's coming towards the fire signs for the first two weeks of march okay what the fire signs aries leo and sagittarius can expect okay starting probably monday i'll do aries to pisces again we'll see there's a lot i have to add on this channel so bear with me everybody okay again hit that like share and subscribe button if you like the information that you're receiving okay i'm gonna see what's going on with the fire signs the first two weeks of march march 1st to the 14th okay I'll do my cards a different way. Okay, I'm not like everybody else out there. So, Archangels, Ancestral Guides. What can the fire signs expect for March 1st to 14th? March 1st to 14th. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. What can they expect March 1st to the 14th? Okay, we're going to get this in. My arm look all naked and <laughs> anyway for those out there in YouTube land I will be going Facebook live March 1st at 1 30 from my business page readings by Nikai Nikki n-e-i-k-k-e-i -K -K -E -I, Nikki n-i-k-k-i -K -K -I. again I will be on Facebook live it will be worldwide Facebook live March 1st for Oracle readings What do we have for the fire signs what is coming towards them what can they expect from march 1st to the 14th 2021 spring is approaching i don't know about y'all but i got my gear ready mm. let me get another card spirit i want to be clean on something oh lord luck whoever was blocking y'all luck and y'all creativity and suppressing your happiness whoever's blocking it hindering and delaying it i'm gonna tell you right now those blocks those delays those hindrances are now broken okay they are broken they're broken by your deities they're broken by your ancestors those blocks are bro broken and removed delays as well Ain't no delays to your success and your happiness. I see the clover here. Let me get one more card. I'm trying to get one more card. Yo, I see the key to the key to me is wealth and success. Okay. There's something that y'all need in order to be more successful in your endeavors. Fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Let me get one more card. For the fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, please, Archangels, Ancient Ancestors. No, I didn't want to fly out me a nosy. What is needed? What is coming towards the fire signs? First two weeks of March, 1st to the 14th. For Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius, the first two weeks of March, 2021. What's to be expected? What's coming towards them? Okay, Spirit is speaking. I guess they said what they had to fucking say. But we gonna see. Ooh. Yeah, okay. Somebody around y'all may not be stable and they trying to linger on it, y'all. Don't let that happen because to me, that's an energy vampire. Yes, this individual may need your help and you can help them at a distance. I'm not saying don't help the individual, 
You can help them, whether that's a family member, whether that's a lover. But you have your success, um, your ancestors and your spirit guides are saying, you need to focus right now on your success and your stability. Okay? Because at the end of the day, who going to do you? Or who going to help you? Got it? Okay. So basically, y'all have the clover. Okay, you have the clover here. There's a lot of luck, serendipity, creativity, blessed with fortune. So look at the clover. A lot of y'all are blessed with a lot of fortune. A lot of good luck is coming in where there was a period of no luck. Everything was going wrong. Every time you try to be creative, you couldn't. It's like you had creative block. An example of a creative block would be writer's block. If you were writing a novel, writing a story, or even e or even just manifesting, because manifesting has a lot to do with writing down things that you want to come into fruition. If you couldn't even manifest, that was because someone is was lurking in the background. Also, the planets were retrograde. There's a lot of shit that was going on. Excuse my language, but there was a lot of things that was going on. That was trying to hinder your luck. It's not anymore. I'm going to tell you why. Mountain is in reverse. See? This is the mountain. When people were trying to block, hinder, and delay your ass. But fire signs. You got the... You seen I dropped that shit. <laughs> fire signs. You got the mountain in the reverse. Okay? There are no more blockages. Okay? There's no trouble. In the past, there was a lot of trouble. There was a lot of obstacles. Because you had a nemesis. An enemy. Whether that was family... Okay, you could have been sleeping with the enemy, a lover. Okay, that nemesis could have been smiling in your face all the time trying to take your place, backstabber. That could have been someone cloaking themselves to be um, what you wanted them to be, to be seen as what you wanted them, them to be seen as. All the while they were a nemesis, someone very hateful, greedy, jealous, male, female, fitted where it apply, family member, usually it is your family members, okay, a friend. Most of y'all probably grew up with this individual. Some of y'all married to this individual. Some of y'all dating this individual. Some of y'all friends with this individual. Whatever the case may be, there was someone in the way of your luck and your fortune. Your ancestors and spirit guides, your archangels and your deities are telling you that there is no longer a blockage. So... Some of you possibly got rid of this individual. You broke up with this individual. You're no longer speaking with this individual. You blocked this person. And when you blocked them, you got the key. Okay? A lot of success is here. It's telling you what is needed right now and what's important to you right now. You're going Some of you will be receiving a revelation upon your success and how to achieve your success. Some of you are going to receive a revelation on what's necessary for you to become successful if you're not already successful because remember in the past you had a lot of blocks and a lot of hindrances that were blocking you from your success it was blocking your creativity your luck in having creativity it was blocking you this person was blocking you okay they were sending out like negative wavelengths to your mental all right, be mindful. A lot of people do more mental magic than they do physical magic. Physical magic meaning using herbs, oils, candles, okay? Incantations is air magic, okay? Mental magic is thoughts, evil eye, envy this in the head, sending out negative wavelengths. When I say that, I mean sending out bad thoughts to your ass to block you, okay? This person shouldn't have this. This person shouldn't have that. Why they having an I ain't got? They, they have a, 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 what is that word? The person that was envious of you, that was blocking you, that you po possibly got rid of, and if you didn't get rid of them, you are about to, and if you don't get rid of them, the universe will do it for you. Your spirit guides, your ancestors see that this person or these people ain't sitting right with you, so they're going to get rid of them because they're blocking your success and your creativity, your ideas. Some of them are stealing your ideas. That's why you're not being creative. Some of them are astral projecting into your dreams at night, trying to steal your energy and block your creative thoughts, processing. Okay, look, 
But there's someone coming in that's necessary for your success. This person is very necessary, ne very necessary for your success. This person is possibly born year of the dog. Okay, this person is very loyal, dependable, and trustworthy. This new person, they're not here yet. You're going to be very content with this individual that is coming in. So what's coming in for you, fire signs, is that blocks are being removed to your creative ideas and your ability to create success for yourself on your own, especially those that are entrepreneurs. There is ideas coming in for you. You got rid of your nemesis, your enemy, and now what well, universe did. And now the success, you got the key to success, basically. Look, look like my earrings I'll be wearing. I swear to God. <laughs> my earrings represent Baron of the Cemetery and open roads. Okay, that's why I wear my earrings, my skeleton key. Because if you think of a skeleton key, skeleton key unlocks what? All doors. Road opener. Okay? To success. All doors to success are opening now for you. And there's someone in the picture coming in for you they are not yet here fire signs this person is possibly born year of the dog or they have qualities of that which is very loyal very trustworthy dependable okay so fire signs now that you got rid of this individual and your creativity flowing in i hope some of you did okay trust some of you don't be spending all the money in one place. Some of you I see working real hard. Got your nose to the grindstone on your businesses. I heard most of you fire signs got all businesses. So some of you possibly have two to three businesses. You know, like me, myself, and I have a lot of businesses. This tarot channel and me being a tarot card reader or psychic is not just the only business that I have. Okay. Working hard. You doing your thing. You focused on success right now. I see that most of you fire signs, you're loyal and dependable, and you don't need it. a nemesis in your group trying to, you know, stop your abilities and your creativity just because they're fucking jealous. Someone was doing a lot of mental magic on you fire signs. It was a lot mental, more mental than physical. Okay. And if it was physical, it was physical and mental for most of you out there. Not everybody. Okay. Look, burdens are being released. If someone was putting burdens on you, it's being released. Okay. You're like, I ain't got time for this. I got my own shit to worry about. Yes. Okay. 10, 10 across the board. Okay. There's 10, of, 10 of wands reverse and the 10 of, look at this, 10 of cups, happy home, happy life. Okay, some of you are very content. Some of you work out of your home as uh, entrepreneurs. You may do hair. You may have a salon in your house. You may cut hair in your house. Okay, some of you don't want to move forward with that individual that was hating on you. All right, you got the wheel of fortune in reverse. You knew that this individual was bringing you bringing you down, and you you basically don't want to move forward with them at all. Okay, something is not finished in the house as well regarding your home and your happiness okay let's see what's going on here there's a cycle not yet closed out all right regarding your home situation some of you are in the process of moving all right you haven't picked a location yet but the place that you will be moving to definitely will be a good place for you good energy lots of good energy i see the tower here okay the tower is here wheel of fortune reverse so what i see here for most of you fire signs here with the tower here and the, and the wheel of fortune reverse there was a lot of bad energy at your home that was causing this commotion that was causing blockages to your luck and success i'm looking right at it someone wanted you to have bad luck and misfortune they were sending it from their house Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they were sending it from their house, whoever this individual was. They were happy and content that you were having bad luck, that you were having no stability. They were trying to, ooh, they were literally trying to block your damn money. Ten of Pentacles in the reverse, okay, is instability, okay, blocked money. 
money not coming to you okay ten of pentacles uh, is um my version of not having a happy home because if you ain't got no money your home ain't happy i'm sorry to tell y'all but that's my belief i see five of cups here whoever was blocking your shit is in regrets right now some of you this was your kid's father or baby mom yeah this was the one you were with that was blocking your shit you were with this individual look this person was blocking you you may have told this person that you're breaking up with them and not want to be with them and now they're having regrets because this is the person that tried to block your damn money the tower came down on a blocks though let me tell you right now the tower came down on a blocks if you had someone trying to block your money mo most of you they ain't gonna resonate with anybody most of you this was your lover yeah because they were in the third party spending their money somewhere else with somebody else a younger female younger earth sign towards virgo capricorn strong virgo and this bitch was taking the money and spending it third party see they didn't want you to move on from them they didn't want you to be successful and creative but they're in the third party with this earth sign. Are you fucking kidding me? Excuse me. I'm so upset right now. YouTube, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Okay. They were in the third party with somebody else. Now, third party, if it's not a lover or it's a relative, someone they were fucking with at work, whoever this, this outside individual is that you do not know about, you fire signs, your person that you were breaking up with was mad. You were leaving them. But yet, how could they be mad when they were screwing somebody else? third party working against you okay they would take their money and spend it on this third party but they didn't want you up there making money how the hell you know what a lot of creativity in the home and trying to build up yourself that i do see fire signs okay blockages are now removed and now the bad luck is turning returning to this earth sign here so what I'm getting is that these these mofos is talking crap about you behind your back, especially this earth sign. She about 21 to 25, okay, towards Virgo Capricorn. All right. Talking about, oh, can we work on it? Because I see a message between this person and your partner, how they can work on stuff. And your partner's trying to block you block you from knowing about this situation block your creativity block your money your finances and your success towards your business but you got someone coming in that's going to help you rebuild and reestablish your self fire signs like i said this individual is born year the dog or they have the characteristics of a person that is born year the dog loyal and trustworthy this individual may come and tell you about the third party don't be surprised there's a huge change coming in that third party situation we all know what that change is there's messages coming through what the hell is that there's patience someone patiently waiting regarding a change that's coming concerning this third party that was causing a lot of instability around you a lot of instability there's a change coming yeah i know i already know what the changes i already know what the changes mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah empress you're the empress fire signs you have comfortability you have luxury look how beautiful you look look at the fire see the flowers that represent passion the red is passion and fiery controlling and commanding in a, in a positive way not a negative way you are the empress some of y'all have children out there okay you're taking control over this situation to bring about a change that's you patiently waiting for the change to come in some of you are patiently waiting for this change to come in others of you got rid of this individual some of you don't want to deal with a third party it's bringing too much stress drama and strife Others of you are waiting to leave this situation. Fire signs. I'm about to pull a moon oracle for you to see what's going on. One more card. Yep, there's a message coming in to you, fire signs. An emotional message coming in. All right, your individual may want to work it out with you. It's up to you. 
my cards fell. They may want to work it out to you. It's up to you if you want to work it out with this individual. Let me get one more card. I'm being nosy. What's this message? Ooh, we here. Not good. Queen of Cups reversed along with the Page of Cups. Okay, someone probably want to argue with you. An emotional argument is coming through. Okay, could be you. Could be you. Someone feeling a little bit out of control. They can't hold back their anger about what's going on. Some of you may have had an um, argument with the, with your significant other about this third party. Because some of y'all know about it already. Cups is a high intuition here. And I see cups across the board. Okay, it's high intuition here. Some of you not holding back, period. Like, this other person is losing strength. Whoever this other female is. I see a lot of y'all, once you let the situation go, there's going to be healing that take place. All right? Others of you might run into an Aquarius born year to dog. But I see that you're becoming successful in your business endeavors, fire signs. And you're not even worried about this individual anymore. Some of you did let go of this person. And moved on about your business to focus on your business success. The person coming in the Aquarius born year to dog. Okay, or this loyal individual you have yet to meet. Like I said, it's coming in to help you fire signs. All right, this person is trustworthy, male or female, doesn't matter. They're very trustworthy. Okay, let me get a moon or a cool card, please. Archangels, ancient ancestors, regarding the fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, for the first two weeks of March 2021, March 1st to the 14th. Let me get another one. March 1st to the 14th. March 1st to the 14th. The fire signs. Then we can close this reading out. Ooh, they gave me three. Okay. So, a win-win outcome is forecast. Yeah, so you ain't got to worry about this, fire signs. You got this. All right? Full moon in Libra. Something's going to occur on the full moon in Libra. The outcome... You will see what it is with the full moon in Libra. Wait for it. Wait for the outcome regarding this situation that you are going through. Emotions are running high. Try to control your emotions, okay, regarding this. Emotions are going to be high. Like I said, you got the water cups here. You got the queen of cups reversed with the page. So there's a lot of emotional news coming this way. Emotions are running high, all right? But it's a win-win situation, all right? Some of you going to walk away and leave that person with who they with. Whatever. Okay. Two tears in the bucket. Fuck it. You're very close to achieving your goal. This is in regards to your business, your finances, and working on your home and yourself. Self-love and self-care as well. You're taking care of yourself, achieving what you want to achieve, fire signs. You're staying focused on your number one star player, and you're going for the goal. Your hard work is paying off. New moon and Capricorn. Something will occur regarding New Moon in Capricorn, regarding what you are working on, that project that you are working on. There could be some money coming in for most of you out there, especially you entrepreneurs, but it ain't going to come by uh, hands alone. Hello, you have to work out. Go look for the grants and the loans that you need for your business. Okay, go look for an injector to inject money into your business like a private investor. If you're an entrepreneur, small business, go for that PPP loan or grant. Go for that EIDL. You need to get up off your butt and do the do. With that being said, this is your reading. Fire signs, this is what's coming towards you. All right? March 2021, March 1st to the 14th. God bless.